So Finding Christmas is a story about something that I, I, I think occurs far too often in, in families today, and it's um, Christmas with a split family. Um, and in, in this story, uh, Josh Daniels has to send his daughter away every year for the holidays to go visit her mom. And, and every time he does, it, it just crushes him. It completely breaks his heart. Um, so he forgets Christmas. Christmas doesn't exist for, for him anymore. He basically divorced himself of, of the concept. Um, and this one year, he finally gives in to his mom's persistent pleas to come home for the holidays. Um, and when he does, he's just completely enveloped with, with Christmas. And as much as he feels bad about it, it just makes his heart sink even further. Um, he sees happy families preparing for the holidays, going through the mall, and he's like, that's the Christmas that he's supposed to be having with his daughter. Um, so he sneaks away from the family for a while. He seeks solace in this warm little coffee shop, and uh, that's where events occur that uh, kind of leaves him on this journey that uh, re re reminds him what Christmas is really all about. It um, kind of opens his heart back to love of others and, and of, his, of his family, and um, uh, at the end of the day, it makes him realize that sticking your hand in the sand really, really isn't the way for him to, uh, to get through it. Uh, the cover for Finding Christmas, um, I really wanted to capture something that um, it was actually going to go one of two directions. Either, either going to be a picture of Josh lamenting and lost, or it was going to be on the flip side, where his heart truly wanted to be at Christmas. And that's where the cover concept come from, came from. You have snow cascading down, and you have his daughter who's uh, streaking to his arms, and that's, uh, that's what he's wanted all along. So uh, writing Finding Christmas um, really, for me, was unfortunately a little too real. Um, I was going through a lot of the things that the character in the book was going through. Um, a divorce is hard enough, and then the fact that entered my, my, my head of, oh my gosh, there's going to be Christmases without, without my son. And it, it completely shattered me, um, just completely broke my heart. Um, so I was, as I was grinding through that in my heart and in my head, um, a song came on and it just the story just kind of came in and, and flooded out and the end result was a uh, finding Christmas that for me was cathartic and I hope for um, other folks who are going through the same thing that, that I did um, get a little bit of that catharsis that realizing that it, there is something else out there and, and sticking your head in the sand isn't necessarily the answer um, it's not doing ourselves or, or, our, or our kids any justice not to mention the, the rest of the family that's around us um, and even if uh, um, you're not in that situation for anybody where Christmas uh, the, or the holidays just weren't really what you expected and it, it, it affected you. Um, hopefully that's, uh, that's the light that, that Finding Christmas will bring. Finding Christmas, at least from a story concept, was, was pretty quick. Like I say, it, it literally flooded out of me. Um, it was a, a huge emotional catharsis. Uh, so once the story was out, um, I, I had a lot of eyes on it. I learned a lot of lessons from the first book that you can't have enough editors. Um, so I had a, a ton of folks looking at it, both from a contextual standpoint as well as to an editing standpoint. Uh, so Finding Christmas can really be found anywhere books are sold. Um, here locally, I love to give uh, credit to uh, to the local independent stores that really take care of um, young authors and, and uh, relatively new newbies like myself. Um, so you can find it in, in Camus, for example, at uh, Cafe Piccolo, you can find it at Camus Antiques um, in Vancouver, you can find it at Vintage Books and Cover to Cover Books, um, and then throughout the gorge in the Portland area, but uh, really anywhere books are sold or, or of course online these days. Or online? Uh, you can get it at, uh, through my website, which is the easiest link, which is um, www.wolfprintpublishing.com, or you can also get it through, of course, Amazon, um, through uh, uh, Barnes & Noble Nook now, um, but ideally, I mean, when you can buy it from one of the from one of the local folks.